this one is a pink fish on the package. It could be like um like those wafer cookies, so it has like a strawberry middle. This is what the fish looks like. It definitely smells like the um, strawberry wafer candy. And it has the filling in the center. This is what the filling looks like. And this side is hollow. So I'll just try it. <laughs> it's like really weird looking, but okay. This is definitely good. It's what you would expect it to be. The filling in the center is really good. And then the outside is more like similar to the ice, like an ice cream cone sort of texture. So it doesn't have much flavor as far as the outside, but that filling is like so good. I would have to give this a four out of five. I like it. And I think I would buy it again if I was in the mood for like a strawberry cookie wafer thing. So I would recommend this one. So next I have this thing. It looks like it's vegetable potato chips. And it looks like typical like vegetable um, straws. And let's see what it tastes like. Well, this isn't bad. It's got a little good flavor to it. Um, you can definitely taste the potato and little hints of vegetables. I think this is a good snack. And it's a good like side item with like a sandwich or something. Really good flavor. I give this like a four out of five. Okay, another snack. And this one doesn't seem to have as much seasoning, but it is more of an orange -y color. So let's see. Okay, this is shrimp flavored candy. It reminds me of shrimp, and I was like, is this shrimp? And I see a little picture of a shrimp there. So yeah, this is like shrimp candy. It tastes really good. It's a lighter flavor, but you definitely can pick up that shrimp vibe. So they did a good job with this. I would give this like a four out of five. This is really good. Okay, next I have some, I guess little chips as well. And it's turtles on there. Hopefully this is not like, turtle flavored. No, maybe just like turtle shape. Okay. So it's little crackers. Let's see. These don't taste bad. It's sort of like right in the middle of being sweet and savory, so it's hard to say. Okay, so I would give this a, maybe like a four to five. It has a very interesting balance between the, the sweet and savory, which I think is pretty cool. Okay, next I have this one with a panda bear on it. See what it looks like. Well, it's broken up, but it's like, seems like a regular cookie biscuit texture. So let's see if it tastes them. Um... Oh. This is very good. It has like a butterscotch or like a shortbread cookie vibe. Definitely familiar with like an American candy or um, like with the American cookie that we have here. It's very good. So I would give this a, a 4.5 out of five. It's got a good flavor. There's not a lot in it, so it's definitely really small. All right, so next I have this little marshmallow looking thing. So I know the other one had like a pink filling, so let's see, but this one, yeah. Okay, so this is actually a chocolate filling. And it's not like liquidy chocolate or like a jello chocolate. This one's more like a regular like fudge chocolate texture. It's actually very good. So this is basically just like a chocolate candy I can see a lot of people liking this. There's not much to it though. It's just chocolate and then you got that marshmallow on the outside. But I give it like a three out of five. It's got like a you know, good chocolatey thing going on. So this is the next one. This one has two like wafer things. Not quite a cookie texture. But this is what the one looks like. It seems like it'll be more of like a plainer 
taste to it. Yeah. It's got actually it's got a decent amount of flavor. It's similar though to the shrimp, um, the shrimp cookie cracker thing. But just with a slightly less flavor. Now I give that like a maybe like a two out of five. So this next one looks really cool. I believe this is a cherry flavor. And they put a toothpick in here, I guess, so you can pick out the candy. So I have one here. It definitely has a cherry flavor. I'm not a big fan of cherry flavor. <laughs> but it's not like a strong flavor. It's just like kind of bland. So I would give this one like, like a two out of five. Now moving on to this other lychee looking candy and it's got like a little tiger kitty thing on it and just the yellow in the middle no filling or any like fruit chopped up within it so let's see what flavor it is this isn't bad i think it's going more along the lines of like a pineapple flavored thing but it's like a typical like jello lychee um, texture. So I give it like a three out of five. I'm not crazy about it. Okay, so next I have a grape gummy candy. And it just comes in this purple package. Not a big fan of grape flavor, but let's see if it delivers on how strong it is. And it's a very small candy, it's just, just one line. Oh, it's bubble gum. Okay, that's why it's small. Well, it definitely got the great flavor across, but it's not like a super strong flavor. I give it like a two out of five. So next is this candy thing here. I'm not sure exactly what flavor is this supposed to be, but it's a very small candy, and it's got this like chalky, you know, like texture. You can definitely tell. It's like a, a lime green color, so I'm guessing it might be like a lime flavor. But let's see. So this is actually more along the lines of like a green apple flavor. I love green apple. Just not a fan of the texture. Too much like chalky weirdness, but the flavor is fine. It's not like a strong green apple, but it's definitely an apple thing. I give this a 2.7 out of 5. Okay, so next I have this. It seems like it's a cookie or a cracker. And it's got these green sprinkles on top of it. Very interesting looking. It's very like christmas -y vibe for sure. That matches this season. But let's see what flavor it's supposed to be. This actually isn't bad. It reminds me of Peeps. Like the Peeps candy, but just a crunchy version of that, basically. And it even has, you know, like a sprinkle coating thing on the outside. But yeah, this is definitely like Peeps. Okay, so next I have chocolate chip cookies. So this is their package for that. It comes with two cookies. It looks very good on the outside. Can't really see, you can see a little bit of chocolate chip through there. And it's more of a harder texture. And I'll try a little piece here. Seems like it has a chocolate filling for sure, like chocolate filling inside of it. It actually has a really good flavor. Like the chocolate in the middle is just really yummy. So I would um I would recommend this. And then the, the, the cookie part on the outside has like a good sort of butter flavor, like a butter cookie, I guess. So it's very good. I would give this a 4.5 out of 5. I would definitely recommend this one. It's really yummy. Okay, so lastly, I have these M&M looking candy things. Doesn't have very much writing on it, but I'll try one of them. I'm assuming it's like chocolate filled. It definitely is. So this is M&M's all the way. So I give it like a four out of five. So yeah, this was a lot of fun being able to try Japanese candy and I definitely have some other um, 
candies from different countries on my list but this was definitely fun I really enjoyed this um, definitely a lot of good flavors I would have to say these candies or these snacks were my favorite they had a lot of good flavor different flavor components to them so yeah this was a lot of fun I definitely am looking forward to getting my next candy baskets <laughs> okay well thank you guys so much for watching this Japanese candy food review and um, stay tuned for more <laughs> I will definitely have more videos up for you guys soon so please subscribe and hit the notification bell next to the subscribe button to see every time I upload a new video and I will see you guys soon